it's pretty impressive. If you've never seen a, an SMT line and how it works, it's really an engineering marvel how it does this. Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of CVTV. My name is Carlos and I'm here with David Dockin, owner of Coralview. How are you, Dave? Doing well. How are you today, Carlos? I'm doing well. So what is today's small show about? Uh, we're just talking about hydros and where it's made. And uh, and, and it's made right here in, in the USA. It's, it's made mm -hmm. right here in our facility in Slidell, Louisiana. Nice. So we have, um, so now when you say made in USA, what do you really mean? Is like, is it assembled? Is it, what parts are made in the USA? How, how, explain that to me. Yeah. So, you know, basically with hydros, everything starts with a, a printed circuit board, a PCB. And, that, mm -hmm. and so we actually uh, have the boards. We do all the engineering in-house. We have boards that are made, the raw physical boards. We bring them into our facility here where we then uh, have invested into an SMT, which is a surface mounted technology assembly line. And that's how we then populate the boards. And then from that point, we uh, take the boards out and then we do all the software and diagnostics from that point. So to where so the you SM have a... Yeah. So go. the SMT machine grabs a, so you receive a green board and it's just this green thing with nothing mm -hmm. on it. It's nothing. completely yep. blank and empty. And then yep. this machine takes all this little, tiny little LEDs, resistors, capacitors, tiny. <laughs> and tiny. Yep. I mean, some of them, I have to take my glasses up to see yes. them. Some of, some um, of the parts you physically <laughs> can't even handle, you know, exactly. with your hands. Exactly. Um, and then it just lays them all in here. And then you end yep. up with a product like this. Correct. Okay. And from that point, All that's right. not the end. There is also some, some physical hand soldering work. Um, we've actually now invested into selective soldering machines. So mm. that can take uh, the burden of a lot of uh, hand soldering off of us. But we still have that part. And then we, from, from that point, we go into a, a diagnostics, Carlos, where we actually um, put the software, load software onto these boards. And then we have uh, procedures that we test each board um, before it actually goes out or goes through its final assembly. Mm. That's fantastic. So one of the things I know about things made in the USA is that they're standard, you know, in the, when you make things here in the USA, the standard of quality and safety is much, yeah. much, much higher. I know that yeah. um, um, uh, standards of environmental pollutants mm. and everything going out, when you manufacture things, there's going to be fumes, there's going to be things that go out. Yep. And in the United States, the EPA comes over and says, no, you can't do this. You have to vent it correctly. Mm -hmm. You have to pre-filter it. So you're not polluting the environment. So yeah. we have to, we have to abide by those standards. Um, um, so it's a much cleaner uh, manufacturing process, you yeah. know, and I know that you've actually always been an avid um, um, manufacturer that says, if you want, come on over and we'll Absolutely. give you a, a tour of the facility, right? Yeah, absolutely. So if you have a drive in I-10 east or west and you're coming through Louisiana, there's a good chance you'll, you'll pass right past uh, our place off of I-12, which kind of mm -hmm. runs uh, in line with I-10 as you kind of go north of New Orleans. But, you know, more than welcome to stop in, see the facility. It's, it's pretty impressive if you've never seen a, an SMT line and how it works. It's really an engineering marvel how it does this. Um, but a lot of nice things to see here and what we're doing. And, and you can check out the 1,200 gallon uh, show tank in the lobby as well. And we've That's got some right. other tanks around. That's pretty so, cool. Now, yeah. the one thing also, the, the, the great thing about assembly in house mm. and quality control also, which a lot of people don't think is that. The assembly machine, the engineers assembling the the, the 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 device, there are only a few doors from the people that are doing customer yeah. support. So the people yeah. that are on the phone 
you know, helping customers with the product, they're only a few yeah. doors. So usually if there's something that the customer support starts to see a trend, wait a minute, there's something wrong here. There might be something mm -hmm. here that we need to change. It's easy for them to, you know, literally get out of the chair, walk yeah. over to the engineering, talk to the head engineer and say, Hey, yeah. we're having this issue. And Correct. that makes it a lot easier to make corrections. We don't have to talk to China or any other country in Asia. We don't have to talk to Ukraine for software. Mm -hmm. Everything is in-house. And yeah. it's been times when we've had problems on a firmware or software release. And within a day, we can release a fix for that firmware update. So everybody's okay. Let's be yeah. real. You know, software is constantly changing and you fix one thing, but inadvertently you end up, you know, causing a problem somewhere else. We try yeah. to do testing. We have beta testing, but sometimes it just gets through those barriers mm -hmm. or failure points. And when it makes it to the public, at least we can make those changes rather quickly. Absolutely. You know, um, uh, and then the one thing that we have also is that when you have things made in America, that means you have people employed here yeah. in the United States to help you with the product. Yeah, really, we appreciate the the support and that, you know, it's keeping people with jobs and, and, and they're right here in the U.S. So we're, we're definitely yeah. thankful for the support of Hydros and, and, and the employees here. That's that correct. There's no call employed. center. No, there's no call yeah, center. Not we don't see or... <laughs> you're not going overseas no. to somewhere in, no. you know, India or some other country no. or Brazil or Mexico. We're not everybody that works here is employed in the United States. We have, yep. we have people all over the country, actually. That is the one yep. thing about CoralView that is CoralView. It's very, very, very much uh, forward progress thinking because you know, we have a lot of employees that are all over the country instead of mm -hmm. all the employees in one location. Yep. Exactly. Well, thank you, Dave. Thank you for that explanation. I know people constantly ask and sometimes assume that Hydros is a product that we import from another country. No, it's a 100% yep. American made assembled uh, product by CoralView. So if you have yep. any questions about Hydros, just feel free to head over to support.coralview.com. One of our reps in there is going to be able to answer your questions right away within 24 hours, or you can always head on over to Facebook at the Hydros uh, community group. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.